quick look here at a solution CLD put together in order to allow uh, easy creation of expenses and expense reports in Financial Force PSA based on an integration with a credit card or a bank uh, to pull in a, a feed of credit card transactions. So here I am uh, in, in Salesforce. I have an integration, a nightly feed that comes in from my credit card. Um, and I'm a, a resource in the organization, so I can see here a list of recent credit card transactions uh, that have come in from the bank. So I can see I've got a trip here where I've got a car rental, uh, a hotel stay, in-flight Wi-Fi, and expenses that have been incurred on my credit card. What I'm able to do here is, so this is one interface where I can go straight from my credit cards into an expense report. I can either create a new expense report here, or I can take an existing expense report. Um, or on a line-by-line -line level here, I can say, okay, my hotel stay here, let me go ahead and I'll put that in, I'll add that to my Acme project travel, this is for a customer trip, and this is a lodging expense. Um, this would be billable, I can mark an expense as personal, or a duplicate if I've already entered the expense, and so on. Um, what I can do here is I can open that up and I can say, hotel stay two nights and over here I can drop my receipt right in there. So what this does is, another thing I can do is I can itemize it. So if I had a hotel stay but I had uh, meals included in it, I can break this up and say, well, a um, hundred of it was lodging and then I had some meals as well and that's seventy dollars and thirty two cents it'll make sure the math adds up if it doesn't add up mark it in red there and won't let me save it so I can itemize it and actually create two expenses out of a single card transaction okay so that's one let me add that so that adds that transaction as an expense to the expense report with the receipt and the description and everything else real quickly here here's my airfare expense I'm going to do the same sort of thing so um, again same expense report and let me drag my airfare receipt over onto it and that's about it so it's that simple what you can see here is this gives me the ability to add to multiple expense reports if you want to so I've got some other administrative or for other trips so so that's one interface now if we go over to the expense report we'll see here in addition to the ones that I just added there's my airfare there's my lodging I've got other expenses on here these might be ones I entered through my mobile app, right? Um, so I've uploaded the expenses uh, through the app, but I haven't matched them to transactions because I incurred the expense, took a picture of the receipt, created it, and then later on the transaction comes in through the integration. The way to match those up here is to go into this match transaction screen from the expense report, and you'll see here the ones I created, they're already matched. There's my hotel stay, there's my airfare. Over here I've got a car rental, a uh, dinner, and parking. So to do this, I find the, the matching transaction. There's my parking expense at the airport. I can just drop it in there. My meals expense uh, over here. And then my car rental expense is right here. And it's that simple. Um, since I took these with my mobile, I've already got the receipts on them and I've matched them up that way. So now back on the expense report, I have all of my expenses with, with attachments on them all matched up to their transactions. Um, and with this receipt attachment screen here, here's another area where um, I can match up attachments to my expenses if I don't have them or if I want to manage them here. So again, quick look, two main interfaces, create or add expenses right from a transaction list that comes in from the bank or start with the expense report and match transactions that have come in from there. Thanks for watching.